Lillian Thiemann has survived AIDS for 19 years thanks to cocktails of multiple anti-HIV drugs. I have to say that uh, the side effects initially for me were pretty startling. You know, uh, but then you know, the body's an amazing thing. You can get used to anything o over time. The HIV virus is hard to stop because it mutates and drugs eventually stop working. Harvard researcher Steve Elledge says those treatments target the virus's proteins and that strategy often fails. It makes only 15 proteins and uh, that's not enough to, to allow it to multiply. So it has to take advantage and hijack um, the human proteins to, and make them do its bidding. Elledge wants to outwit the virus by blocking those human proteins before the virus can use them. He and colleague Abe Brass used a new genetics technique to block each protein one at a time in human cells in the lab. Then they tested whether HIV could multiply in the cells. As they wrote in the journal Science, they identified 273 human proteins that the virus needs to multiply. So blocking any one of them should disable the virus in people. We now have 15 times as many possible targets. And so I think there's hope out there that, that there will be some targets that are going to be even better than the drugs that are currently uh, used. Thiemann's experience led her to start an HIV medical education company, so she knows such drugs could be a decade away. I'll keep my eye on the research and hopefully a cure will come down the line and I will be one of the first in line for it. Meanwhile, she says she takes care of herself one day at a time. I'm Brad Closa.